Hello and a very warm welcome. I am Ruchi Sharma. Virtual digital assets or VDM markets were trading mixed in the beginning of the week as the market participants stayed cautious ahead of the various key economic data releases and the Federal Reserve interest rate decision scheduled later in the week. Bitcoin, the largest cryptocurrency by market capitalization, surpassed the $42,000 crucial mark. IC15 index of cryptocurrencies was trading down by 1% at 53,950 points. Meanwhile, the group of recently launched spot Bitcoin exchange-traded funds are seeing combined negative flows for the first time since they opened for trade on January 11th. However, on an optimistic note, the BlackRock iShares Bitcoin ETF became the first among the recently launched spot Bitcoin products to amass over $2 billion in assets under management, surpassing all other recently released spot Bitcoin products. Coinbase, the largest cryptocurrency by trading volume, holds around 995,000 bitcoins worth $42.2 billion, edging towards the 1 million bitcoins mark. Interestingly, Coinbase stands as the most substantial bitcoin holder in the industry, analysts said. As of recent data in the past two weeks, Coinbase recorded a deposit of 16,400 bitcoins worth $694 million. Meanwhile, according to data analytics firm Into the Block, crypto markets have witnessed huge whale activity in the bitcoin space, with whales accumulating around 76,000 bitcoins since the beginning of the year, worth a whopping $3 billion. The reports further highlighted that whales' total accumulation till date stand at staggering 7.8 million bitcoins with a cumulative volume of approximately $294 billion. Interestingly, the recent trend reversal in Bitcoin price will go through a test once again. The key announcement will pose a challenge for global risk appetite while setting the stage for a pivotal next week. It may be remembered that Bitcoin lost nearly 20% on its peak following the listing of the first spot Bitcoin ETF in the US two weeks ago. The global cryptocurrency market cap was at $1.62 trillion, mark decreasing 1% in the last 24 hours. However, the total trading volume increased by 10% to $40 billion. The selling pressure was partly triggered by traders unwinding their positions in the Grayscale Bitcoin Trust GBTC, which, is, which in January converted from a close-ended trust to an ETF to double their profits. In an interesting piece of news, the Solana-based decentralized exchange Jupiter surpassed the cumulative trading volume of the Uniswap V2 and V3 protocols, reaching $480 million in the previous 24 hours. Manta Network surprisingly has experienced a 46% increase in value this week, surpassing market trends. Its total value locked has expanded significantly, reaching $430 million across all blockchains. US stock futures were mixed as Wall Street focused on mega cap tech earnings reports and the Federal Reserve's rate policy decision. Futures tied to the Dow Jones Industrial Average dropped by 0.15%, while S&P 500 and Nasdaq 100 futures were trading flat. Bitcoin was trading at $42,130, down 1%. Ethereum, the second largest crypto, was down by 1.2%, trading at $2,262. Cardano's AT token was down by 1.4% to trade at $0.48. Avalanche AVAX was trading at $35.3, lower 3%. Polygon Matic was trading down by 2.2% to trade at $0.78. Doge, the popular meme coin, was trading down by 2.2% at $0.078. Shiba Inu was trading down by 2%. Ripple's XRP token traded at $0.52, down by 1.3%. However, BNB was up by 0.1% to trade at $307. Solana SOL was up 0.5% and was trading at $97.3. Polkadot was up by 1.1% to trade at $6.8. That's all in CoinMonitor for now. This is me, Ruchi Sharma, signing off. Do like, share and subscribe to 3 TV. And for more information and stories, log on to our website www.3worldstv.io or scan the QR code. Auto TV stay connected with the world of blockchain. Stay up to date with infinite world of NFTs. Come explore and evolve with 3 Auto TV in the metaverse. So many coins, so much volatility. 3 Auto TV delivers the news that matters.
Binance has launched its full-scale digital asset exchange and brokerage platform in Thailand, expanding its global footprint. The platform operated by Gulf Binance has gained essential licenses from Thailand's Ministry of Finance and Securities and Exchange Commission. The platform, which began with an invitation-only phase, now offers a seamless experience for Thai users buying and selling digital assets using the local currency. Its dedicated order book is tailored for Thai baht trading pairs, facilitating smooth transactions and enhancing the overall trading experience. Binance TH is also linked with Binance Kazakhstan, a regulated digital asset exchange supervised by the Astana Financial Services Authority, providing access to digital asset brokerage services. FTX, a fraudulent crypto firm, is holding cash and unloading crypto assets to repay customers whose accounts have been frozen since the platform's collapse in 2022. The company's four largest affiliates, including FTX Trading Limited and Almeida Research LLC, nearly doubled the group's cash pile to $4.4 billion at the end of 2023. FTX raised $1.8 billion through December 8 by selling digital assets and conducting Bitcoin derivatives trades. The company is exploring options to restart the exchange. Since the platform's collapse, bankruptcy advisors have been tracking assets uh, down and striking deals to benefit small accounts. BitGet, the world's leading cryptocurrency exchange and Web3 company, has upgraded its platform wallet security by upgrading all user wallet addresses to multi-party computation technology. The strategic update exemplifies BitGet's commitment to user security, incorporating cutting-edge technologies like the Threshold Signature Scheme and Trusted Execution Environment to set new industry standards. BitGet's MPC wallet addresses introduce a paradigm shift in security standards by leveraging distributed computing, homomorphic encryption and T. Distributed computing eliminates the risk of a single point of failure fortifying the wallet's resilience. Homomorphic encryption ensures secure transactions without exposing private keys, providing an extra layer of confidentiality. TEE fortifies BitGet's MPC wallet, bolstering hardware security and instilling user confidence in the safety of their digital assets.